Yes. Um, welcome back, everybody. Back to the Malfa project. Um, so today we're going to be covering the uh, part where we're going to be making a mask on top of the on top of the wings right there. So we're going to fix that part up. So way right over here. Uh, that to here. So we're going to fix that, and then we're going to follow up with the. Uh, two, and hopefully we will be able to get to a tree as well. Anyway, that's the idea. So, I hope you're all going to be enjoying that. And, uh, let's get started on this. So, the first thing first we need to have is not this, uh, brush. Brush. Uh, we don't need it. We need to actually have the pencil too. Right, that's the pencil too, right? Yeah. Pencil too, good. So we're gonna work on that, and we're gonna be switching that up to five. And now we need to look for the wing. So we're gonna be looking for the wing. It's gonna be wing one, and I'm precisely now. Yes, it's wing one. So what we do, one to half. It's wing one. And we have this layer over here. This that one, and this one. So we want to actually make a layer below this, and we're gonna call it. We're gonna call it. Oh hey blue. Nice to see you as well. So we're gonna be going uh, to uh, call it. Um, Mask one. So we're gonna go over to full white here. Yeah, that's full white. Nice. And now we're gonna be zooming in. So the difficult part here is that. Oh boy. Did I do something wrong here? Oh, I did not erase everything. Oh well. That's easy fixable. Yeah. All right, let's go. Um, so we're gonna go back to wing. We're gonna go to mask one. What we do want to actually have is some here. Yeah. Don't want any of these interactions between the wings. We want to actually have the whole system gone. So and you're probably wondering, like, why am I doing this? It's because of the overlapping quality that needs to be gone. Well, that's the main idea, at least. So I want that removed, and we can close this one up. All right. So technically this is like erasing, but without any destructive measures. I'm gonna take a look here, like what? So this is all one, and the rest is all two. Alright. So that's all one. This is all too. Alright, so now we're gonna be going into the more slightly details. I'm gonna close off wing three. Oops, I'm gonna close off wing three. So we're gonna close wing three because that way we can actually see where we need to draw. I'm 
I'm gonna switch the background to let's let's make a second background and just call it black. Well let's let's go for red instead. Just fill the whole damn thing with red. So I can see where I need to where I need to draw. This should be good enough. Come on, fill it. Thank you. Now I know exactly where I need to draw. Also, it saves me a lot of time. Uh, let's see now. So, yeah. So, yeah, this is all about, you know, knowing where to draw. So, so I can actually uh, get everything done. So this is the uh, this is the mask that I'm be using. So normally this uh, this this, uh, this color will actually go away. Like if I just do this, boom, it's all gone. So there is no harm doing this because this is just a red bar where we can just see where we need to draw. Also, red is like a real good indicator where I need to draw to get everything fixed because you know this is indeed a very annoying color to look at, but hey, you know it helps me finding where I need to draw and where the color is. So. so you can also see the other masks over here like the masks that I'm already using so yeah those masks are important don't get me wrong here yeah, but they are important those masks but this color here is like easy readable like where I need to draw things and yes we can overlap them with the additional color that we need this is just a little like where do I need to draw the line so that nothing else will get away um, but yeah this is just not coloring actually this is just uh, causing a, a layer eh. well this is a layer it is a mask so I don't know what that is so Probably I should call it a more like a mask, but eh. It's a mask for, you know, one specific area. I don't know if I did it the right way though, but uh, you know, it, it, it is one of the ways I can do things. So I'm happy about I'm happy enough. Or happy enough to apply it like this is the way I like it to do it. Because I'm used to it. Well, at least I know now that I don't can I cannot go wrong. At least. Also, as you can see, it just takes a lot of time before I can get everything fixed or get everything colored in. But this is just you know to get the perfect uh, mask for the connection between the both of the wings. That's why I'm doing it. I'm not doing it just for the colorization. Uh, I'm doing this for the uh, to get the connection between the wings correctly. This way, you know, the mask will prevent the wings from uh, clipping, t uh, prevent the texture from clipping uh, into each other. But of course, then the drawing is going to be more difficult to draw. Oh, hey, Mark. Nice to see you as well. But yeah, it, it uh, it's a real uh, it's a real uh, thing that you know. Uh, I like to I like to make sure that I have, and that is like, this is just coloring, but it is not actually coloring. It's just mapping, or well, masking. It's not the best way, I know, but hey, it is my way. I like I like to overdo this because you know. This drawing does have a lot of overlapping, fa uh, overlap, overlapping places, 
because it's a bird and you know a bird is really hard to not have an overlapping part like you know the because I did not draw it in one go because I draw it in different kind of objects let's put it that way just for me to get the right position or the right texture it means that th these things are I'm gonna be probably gonna be combining them all so I'm gonna be uh, how do you say I'm gonna be combining the colors no, no, no. I'm gonna combine the masks and then put all the masks in one go so I'm gonna put all the masks in one line in one file or eh that's not not necessary but I need to make sure that all the colors are gonna be put on, um, above the mask but under the uh, under the uh, under the drawing part so yeah under the outlines that's more that's more what I was looking for Yes, space junk. It's color, but it's not technically color. It's only color for uh, the masking. So it's not it's not white. It's more like a masking color. But yeah, it is. It's pure black. It's pure red, so that I know where I can where I, that I can see the mask. Otherwise, white on white won't work. You know, this is a little bit of a strange old deal. There you go. But damn, coloring is gonna be like a pain in the ass. Certainly, there would be a better way to do this, but I, uh, I'll get there eventually. I found the way. I will find the way. Now, if we put the wing. Perfect. There you go. This should now be fixed. Blech. Boom. Nothing to see here, friends. Nothing to see. Uh, now I just want to see something. All right. Uh, if I add over, oh, I want to have a layer. I want to see just. Clone group, clone group, transparency mask, filter mask, colorization mask. What does this do? I just want to know. I just want to know. I'm just being really curious right now. Just want to know. Hmm. Oh, that will work. So that's how the colorization mask works with them. Reverse. What does it do? So I can go for gray scaling or white scaling, or what is this? What kind of what kind of abomination did I spawn? That <sighs> ah yes, yes. Let's not do that. Let's not do that. Let's not do that. Let's let's just remove this casually. Let's abandon this. Uh, can I abandon it? Ah yes, remove. Yes, I like that. Uh, not touching that. Not touching that at all. Holy hell. All right. So my approach is the only approach right now, so I'm going to be doing that instead. Good, 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 
good. Now we're gonna be touching that at all. All right. Um, now we're gonna be focusing, aiming on this part because we fixed that part. We fixed the wings. Uh, let's see. We need to now fix. Uh, I already want to continue first here, so that I then can fix this. So yeah, we're gonna do first two and then one. All right. But yeah, the wings is done. The wings are now successfully uh, uh, weakened. Oh well, better. There you go. That's back on normal. That's back normal. That's back normal. I need to go here. So I need to deactivate that and get this. So getting back to the five pixels here. There you go. Ah, okay. We're back again in this place. So I'm gonna be changing up the. No, first switching back to the keyboard. There you go. So we're gonna work on this, and we're gonna. Uh, we need to remove this actually. So we need to find out where that is. So no hat, no legs. It's in the till, right? Yes. Right. So this is that. Yeah. That's another layer, by the way. to find that part. That's the part that I need. There you go. So yeah. I've been working on this part like for now and uh, I need to just get everything done. So um, this is going to be fixed. So I'm gonna Get that done. So now we need to focus on this. Oh boy. Ah, oh boy. You know, back in the days, you know, when you have like this kind of a problem, like you're repositioning and you don't have digital artwork to work around with, but you had pencil and paper. Oh man, this would be a nightmare to do. Just, you know, redoing every single thing you did. So you're technically ruining the whole paper. Man, oh man. Yeah. A uh, so hard to do. I should definitely move to this one. This way I can just casually do this. Yeah. Should 
Should I zo should I use the zoom in the version here or should I zoom out? That's the main question here. Mm. If I play it like this. No, I need to. I need to actually use the normal vision then. Yes, I do. Oh boy. <laughs> there you go. Ah, oh, this is gonna be a nightmare. The approach of my pencil is actually not working upon that upon that place, so yes, I am now actually using this way. This way I will be able to get to the part where I want to be. Any problematical issues. It's such a shame that really I try to do my very best here to get everything done, but it's just really hard to do. When it comes to to these nasty little detail gaps, because I need to use my previous detail. Oh my my eyes! Oh. Yep, I'm really close to this screen right now, just because I want to do this focusly. But I cannot zoom in because otherwise um, I ruin the uh, not position, but uh, what is it called? What is it called? Come on, I can do this. Mm. Yeah, the tech, the texture is not going to be in, in, uh, identical, and because it's not going to be identical, the uh, problem is that it then won't work. Because I'm giving every single thing an identical look, identical feature, like the the wings or the you know the big wing, the big feathers, they all have. They have all identical textures, so if I then if I then not use that identical uh, perception, uh, identical uh, identical drawing style towards a thing that is actually the same as the rest, it won't look like the same. Therefore, the uh, the person that looks at it will get confused. Like, why is this thing not drawn like that if everything else is drawn like that? And it must be special, but no, it's not special because it's the same thing. If you want to let it, something stand out, then yes, you should do that. Like these crystals, these are really strange. Uh, re they are like crystals, so the, these crystals are standing out because they are different than the textures that I'm using right now. Like the feathers right here, or the other feathers right there. The same goes for the heart, same goes for the hairstyle, it's different than the feathers, therefore it stands out. Therefore, you know, it's going to be representing something. You don't know just yet what, because, you know, I'm not yet finishing with this. I'm probably going to be putting more fluff on it or anything else like that. But, yeah, it's it's really hard to do such a thing. Getting everything done. Uh, getting all the stuff fixed that I want to be fixed. It just takes so much time and effort to get finally done with the business I'm doing but yeah it's necessary because you know if you don't do it then your uh, your picture will look weird and because your picture is gonna be looking weird because your picture is gonna be looking weird it's gonna be looking really strange if something like that is gonna happen also I'm not gonna be using I'm also using the same style here But sometimes I need to keep open the gap, but I don't want to keep the gap open that close. So it's like a shaking hand that represents the uh, fur that's coming into it. Uh, let's see. Ah, 
it's such a hard thing to do because of the amount of s boob shittery going on here. I need to like over here. I need more gaps, so I'm gonna be doing that. So yeah, um, it's one of the things that I'm. Oh, hey, Gemini Salami. Remember it. It looked like a like a stream. <laughs> Remember to like the stream, my dudes. Yeah. You always need to. Uh, it's very thankful that you remind me to like my own stream. Oh wait, I can do that. <laughs> Lol. But no, I I'm not gonna be liking my own stream. That would be horrible. That would be like, oh, I am the best. I'm the greatest now. I'm not the best at doing my my drawings. I might be one of the people that has might be have like focus sensor of you know doing things, but holy hell, I'm gonna be exhausted after this drawing. Just because I need to stare at this drawing for a longer time because I'm doing the most annoying thing, and that's gonna be drawing here. But this is not gonna be the final. Uh, this is not gonna be the final thing that is gonna be representing hair. No, this is just a texture that's gonna be put on on the skin of hair. So what's gonna be happening is that there is also gonna be hair involved. So I'm gonna be using a brush to represent hair and effort, and I'm gonna use that on that on that piece so that it will represent the hair that it's probably gonna be representing. Hmm. Ah, that's gonna be leaving a mark. Ugh. That's gonna be leaving a mark on, on on trying to explain this, but yeah, this 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 people is so yeah. This is just hair. Drawing hair is like the worst. It's the worst when it comes to this kind of hair because I need to keep myself in mind what I'm gonna be doing. So now we're gonna need to switch back over to the ones that is hairy too. Because we're, in, we're at the place where Harry 2 is, that's that place. Where you know, we're gonna go up. We're gonna go up, and then once we're up, we're gonna go down. So, yeah, this is the nasty part. Because this part represents the amount of feathers that we need to get towards. So, this is gonna be our new line. It's a really gentle line, yes, that's true, but uh man. It's gonna be it's gonna be a horrible part to do. So yeah, I need to also get a, I also need to get uh how do you say uh uh the another mask going over here so that I can remove this part. Therefore this will look better. Yeah. So now I need to shut down the wings because otherwise I will not look. Otherwise I will be getting staked here. Wing one, wing three needs to be out, and wing two and four. Yes, thank you. All right, that's gonna be. Yeah, exactly. That's what I thought. It always cracks me up when when he's seeing. Oh, so, so, <laughs> I like. I like. Uh, I liked one of my own videos. It's kind of cringy, I guess, but I mean, I really like it. <laughs> yeah. But, you know, it is always funny that, you know, you could actually like your own video. It's like, I'm gonna do a self promotion on myself. Yay! I did my job. I liked my own liking. Yes. Awesome. Yeah. But yeah, it is, it is a thing that I won't do, but hey, you know, if you really feel like you really liked it, then yes, you should. You should definitely should like your own videos. After all, if you're really happy, if you're really happy about what you did, then yeah, you should. And this needs to be gone. This needs to be gone. There you go. It's gone. It's so hard to do things. Special when it comes to these things, because I need to remove the uh, lines that I drew. 
on some of the parts. Uh, yes, this part over here needs to be gone. There we go. So there you go. It's what I kind of kids call self love. Yes. The self love. Thank you. Thank you, me. Oh, no, thank you. <laughs> uh, it's like uh, making your own video about how great and awesome you are. That's like, oh, yes, w what are you good at? Well, I'm good at drawing. I can admit that. I'm good at it. Doesn't mean that I'm the best, but I'm good at it. And uh, what are you also good at? Well, I am good at learning things. Ooh, very, very nice. And uh, what 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 kind of good? Um, what, where are you good as well? And oh, well, I'm good at uh, knowing knowing things, uh, talking about things. Uh, definitely not getting a joke. Yes, that's also where I'm good at. And uh, what am I also good at? Well, not able to detect sarcasm. That's also where I'm good at. You know, all that lovely stuff where people are always like, hmm, yes. Ah, I am always good at everything. Yes. I'm good at some stuff. I'm not good at all the stuff. I'm not good at talking to people because, you know, I'm a really, really terrible person to start a conversation with sometimes because I'm like, eh, I don't know what I'm talking. I don't know what I'm saying because I'm always looking for the right words and then, you know, the words are not right. Uh, but yeah. I'm trying to do be I'm trying to get better at talking to people because, you know, I need to really get social. Because holy hell, my social, my social, uh, my sh my social uh, approach on you know most of the things is not actually quite good. I'm like, I don't visit people anymore that more often because well, COVID. So yeah, I need to improve my speaking. I need to improve my talking. I need to improve how to talk to people. It's really hard to talk about people if you. Uh, know how to start a conversation, but you don't know how to start a conversation sometimes when uh, you don't have the visuals. Let's put it that way. Face is important. Movement of hands is important for a conversation to go flow. Uh, fl flying. Uh, nice. Uh, going, going great. Yes, that, that's the word. If you have a conversation and you use your hands and your voice and your excitement it actually creates a better it gets creates a better environment than just talking I guess uh, the words are not coming out of my mind this time uh, there you go but yes uh let's see where we are now we're almost half an hour in and we're now just yet finished with number two Yes, very nice. Very nice indeed. Very nice. So yes, number two is very important. Number three is very important. But yeah, we're almost this close to getting towards the coloring, sy uh, coloring system. But I don't want to rush this because otherwise I might be ruining my own damn thing. And when I'm ruining things, that is not a very smart move to do. Alright, uh, let's see and let's compare. Oh man, I forgot it had wings. It is wingless. So yeah, this is what it looks like without wings. And so now, boop, boop, grows just wings instantly. Boom, bam, boosh. Bada boosh, pina boosh. Uh, no. Where's wing? Kaboom, there you go. So now I need to have a layer up on the hairy boys. Uh, hairy, hairy, hairy boys. Uh, hairy boys. Hairy two. Paint layer down. Paint layer three. All right, we can just continue on this one then. And I'll just go here. So yes, the power, the power of miracle of growth. Yeah, indeed, it's a growth miracle already. It's like a Christmas tree. So yeah, Christmas. Now we're gonna just look at this, and we're gonna put the wings back off because you know we don't want these wings to be there when we're doing the hard, 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 hard movement. 
So yeah, we need to get. So yeah, this all needs to be colored. It's funny how you use actually just use the color red to just describe where the layer is. Because normally this is not a very well normally I'm not using that many times a mask, but hey you know, I'm using a mask right now because I I need it. Now we can just summon the wings back on and see where we need to be now. So this is now fixed. This is good fixed, good. And now we need to go over here. So yeah, these are just tiny little things of mask. This is just a tiny mask that you know is left behind, but well, we can fix it. Uh, we can fix the colors, but it just takes a little bit more of uh, how do you say? It? it just takes more steps to get towards the color. If we're gonna be coloring, then I need to make sure that I focus every single part of the. Uh, come on, I know the words. Come on. When I'm doing the uh, when I'm doing the coloring, I need to make sure that the color is above the mask that I'm now currently using. Uh, yes, exactly that word. And to get away with it, is there a way to get away away with it? No, there is no way. There is no easier route than just doing more work. If I'm correct, which I am. Okay, good. So I am correct upon this. I am correct on this. So I'm gonna do that. So I'm gonna be working on a different layer when I'm doing coloring, which then needs to be above the masks, but under the under the outlines. The only way to do that is to collect all the outlines and then merge them into one. Oh wait, make a copy of all the layers and then merge them into and then shove them all into one map. Then merge them. Then put this one away. Therefore, I don't have the white layer. Therefore, I have the white layer, and then I also need to do that with the white layer, and then uh, that's gonna be a horrible task. No, 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 I need to do it the easy way. I need to just put layers on top. Ah, okay. That's gonna be a part, that's gonna be a project on the part because that's a lot of calculations. Don't want to do all calculations right now. I'm having a happy, happy day. I'm not gonna be doing calculations right now. That's that's like math, that's way too many steps for now. We're now doing the parts that we need to do and that is do 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 come on give me give me hints give me hints there you go. We need to now go to tree. Why do we need to go to tree? Because we are done with one and two. So we're done with one and two because look at it. Um I can give you a clear sign. We fixed the errors that we had before. Fix the errors. Ooh, yes. All that spooky stuff. We fixed the errors that we had. And now we're gonna be continuing here. <coughs> to fix the uh head piece. So we're gonna put the head piece on the uh, on this part. This will create a more natural look on the bird. This way I'm gonna be fixing all the stuff that I had before. Um so yeah. We're gonna be fixing that, and then we're this then we're this close. You know, the, um, allow me to just type it into chat. Then we're gonna be uh, hands, hands. Come on, give me hands. And we're then we're gonna be. Uh, come on. Then we're gonna be this close. Yes. Then we're gonna be this close. All right. Then we're gonna be this close. So, okay, good, and so yeah, <sighs> I don't know if I have been rambling down, but I'm going to be forgiving myself because, you know, I did a really good job upon doing a lot, so, I, you know, 
So we're going to be going on the hat. We're going to be looking at the hat. Where do we need to have this layer? We need to have this layer on the white side. No. We need to have this layer on ear 2, ear 3. We need to have it over here. So we need to have below this. Alright, good. Ah, oh, that's even better. And then, then we have this close, yeah. Exactly, this close. So yeah, uh, we're gonna be working on that, so... British. Alright. Whew, um... Allow me to get started here. I need to have my body. I need to have the body part. I need to have a body part. I need to have a sketch on, the, on, on a body part, because holy hell, this is... Not ha this is not helping. I have a simple sketch. Like that, boom. And then we can go like this. Yes, perfect. Uh, why am I always using this bloody damn idiot of a gum when I'm trying to erase things? It's not really helpful. Alright, there you go. Point like this. I'm gonna say this is the bottom hat. Bottom hat. Bottom hat. Bottom head. It doesn't mean that it is a head, but uh, you know, it's the bottom part of the head, so that's why I'm gonna call it bottom hat. Bottom. Bottom hat. Bottom. It's like a bottle put down with less head. <laughs> Am I able to draw these things like this? Yes. Is it better to do it like this? Uh, reverse mode. Yes. Is it better to draw them like this? Let's see. Yes, it is. Alright. Good. So I need to have this hair stopping right here. Yes. So this hair needs to be stopped right here. Okay. And now I need to find a way to get that beautiful hair and stuck on there. So I need to go in like this. I'm gonna use pick numbers here. No, I'm not gonna be using that. So, this is going to be going like this. So, when do I want to have that to happen? I know that this is going to be a thing. So, when do I want to stop doing that? I need to start with it, didn't I? No, I don't have to. I need to start it like here. Alright. A little bit of a pre prep for the bottom part there. Number four. Probably gonna be adding this part as well. Because I need to get that thing there. So yeah. So these ones are yet to be there. I need to remove these. There you go. I need to remove these so that I can get the approach of the belly there. So yeah, we're, we're getting there, we're getting there. We're just doing a lot of work because I made an error. If I didn't make the error then, you know, I'm not human, so that's good. I would be a robot if I did not make an error. Oh, could you imagine me being a robot? That would be horrible. 
We would have been watching ads all day. <laughs> yeah. So yes. A true, a true satisfying hero here, right there. I'm doing my very best to get this small fog and going. Uh, when do I want to have that place to be done? So yeah, we're getting there. We're getting there. We're getting. Eventually, we're getting there. We're just doing our job, fixing all the stuff that has ha had to be fixed. Running out of time, but eh. We're just doing what we, we what we are asked to do, and that's drawing. All right, that's enough for that. I do need to make sure that I have like this, and then approach like that. But then I need to make sure that I have like over here again. Well, that that's gonna be a thing that I need to consider soon. But uh, we're gonna be going here now. Mm -hmm. there you go. Zooming in for the bit for today. Mm. So yes, uh, I hope you already liked what I did. Because you know, I did a lot of things today. I finished off the hard work, you know, work that you know hard people get. It's hard mode already, you know. Insane insanity has not been reached, but it was a really hard mess there. I had to fix it, otherwise it would look look ugly at the end result. You know, you don't want to have the end result be horrible. You know, that's that's not a real good idea. Just take your just take your sweet ass time. Fix your, fix the things that you need to do, and then, you know, eventually, you know, everything will go fine. Just take your time and then breathe in, and think clearly, while you're fixing it. Therefore, you will avoid further, further problems that might occur, while you're doing the design. But yeah, I made a mistake. I made a mistake at the beginning, uh, the positioning of the. Uh, feather, the positioning of the wings was wrong and I fixed it because I saw it and now because I saw it and I fixed it it will save me any further problems that have uh, that will occur in the autonomy because of the amount of fix. Sadly the biggest problem that's gonna be occurring uh, well that's gonna be not now occurring at least, but that's gonna be occurring is that we are gonna be fixing the uh, colors soon. So we're gonna be doing coloring. The main problem with the coloring is gonna be that there are masks which then prevent the coloring from going there. So we then need to go get. We need to do some busy work there, but that's gonna be like a, a little bit messy, but it should be fine eventually once this thing is all done. But yeah, that's gonna be my biggest scary moment. Like, oh damn, I need to go coloring. No. Because as you know, I'm a very good man when it comes to gray when when it go goes to gray. But I'm not a very good person when it comes to coloring because I'm not really a good person to say like, hey, let's go shopping for an awesome new t shirt and I'm gonna pick the most bland one ever. That's uh that's my taste. But yeah, uh, to fix that, I can still use colors, compositions that are already natural in the wild, which I'm probably going to be using. So I'm going to be using color compositions of moths in the wild to overcome my problem that I had beforehand, the uh, coloring problem that I had. Well, at least that's what I'm going to be doing. So I'm going to be using normal colors that are com uh, common in the world and then compare them towards what I have and then fix that. So yeah, uh, at least that's what I'm doing. Well, that's what I'm gonna be doing. Not now, but soon, very soon. It's gonna be like two 
or three three days or four days depends. I think next week already. So hey, you know that's a that's a good that's a good call. Ah, <sighs> well at least we're almost finished. So once I'm done with this, I'm gonna be saying like I'm gonna be saving. Yeah, man. There you go. Easy save, easy life. But yeah. I'm trying to do my very best to get things uh, fixed, but yes. Um, I hope you all do yourself very well. You know, having a great day, having a lovely weekend. Almost, you know, it's it's almost weekend. Only four days to go. I don't know. Wait, five days to go before a weekend has been. Oh, before a week is go gone. But yeah, I'm waiting. I'm waiting for something. Uh. Over two days, there's gonna be a game released, and then you know I'm gonna be playing that as well. Because I really like games. I'm gonna be really liking games. Some of the games I do like. Some of the games are a little bit retarded, but hey, you know they're funny, so I like them. Because something is funny it doesn't mean that they're good, but they're it doesn't mean they're not bad either. I like games that are you know, strategy games, I like them, turn-based. I do also like the real-time strategy options. But yeah, that's what I'm doing. I'm a really strategic man. I really like to, you know, think before I do something. That's why I also like card games. Like Pokemon or MTG or Yu-Gi-Oh! Those, those, those card games were my best. The only funny thing is actually I did actually do only Pokemon for the co uh, for the cards, not for the for the game itself, because I was like, nah, man, I'm not gonna be doing that. <laughs> Who needs that anyway? So let's let's just take a look already. No, no words. Oh, I knew that I forgot something. Anyway, blue. Um, since we're all here, let's let's just let's do it anyway. Happy birthday for you. Happy birthday for Blue. Yeah, that's that's good enough. <laughs> so yeah, Blue, congratulations on your birthday, by the way. Oh, Cyberpunk, same boyfriend is gonna buy is gonna buy it. Ooh, sweet. How are you all doing for today? Well, I totally did not forgot the Blue's birthday. Totally did not forgot. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, uh, let's zoom out. <laughs> I was I I knew that I forgot something when I had to bleep on my telephone. I had it in my telephone. I had it in my calendar, but no, I forgot it. Like a dumb dumb I am. Ah yes. Let's put it like this. <laughs> I'm just gonna be waiting here. Uh no 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 no. Oh, that this is four. So, ooh, this is four. This is pressing four, people. Look at me being scary. Yeah. Now I want to have five. Oh, now I want to have five. Yes. All right. Uh, let's see. What do we need to do now? Um, we have over here something. So we have not colored this part up. Okay. Cool. Hmm. I need to do this with the. I need to do it the or the all the way like this, right? Yes, I need to do that on the bottom side as well. All right. So I'm gonna be doing that anyway. I'm gonna be fixing the last part up, and then I'm gonna be calling it quits today. Anyway, uh, did, did, nope. Nope. Um, I need to go to here to this one, right? Yes. All right. Let's go white, and then go like this, and then we can just there you go. Fix that. All right. Now we're gonna. I'm gonna be just doing this uh, second layer paint. Yes. 
So I'm gonna be doing something really awkward right now. And there it is. Show me the body. Yes. Like that. I need to have like this. Like this. Yes. And then how am I gonna do this? I'm gonna be doing it like this. Alright, so how do I do then this? So I'm going to be starting here. Alright, so every single time I need to go. Whoop, 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 whoop. Oh. So yes, like that. So I do need to do that. And I then need to go for this kind of approach on the parts. Yes. Alright. So that's gonna be that. So I need to fix this. I need to fix this. I need to fix that. So yes. Now it's the big question how I'm going to be doing that part. Ooh, not today. I'm going to be having small game pizza and cake on the... Ooh, that's going to be lovely. That's going to be lovely. Pizza cake. Oh, I have never heard of that one, but that sounds really good. I do like pizza. I do like cake. Insect. Insect. There you go. Uh, I wanna know. I wanna know. How is this going on? There you go, Mantis boy. Ah, uh, no. I can't pull this off. Alright, so it is normal, but I need to figure out how to do this then. So. It is an insect looking bird. Bird skin does have crocodile look like. I can combine them. I can combine them, yes I can. But should I then move them, should I make them like feathers? Should I go for this kind of approach then? Or should I then better go for? Or should I go for this kind of approach? Hmm. I should go for the same approach as normal. I should go for the feather look, but I need to put them in a position so that they will form this kind of approach. So I should go for I should go for this kind of approach. Okay. So not for this kind of approach, I need to go for this kind of approach. So not this, that, that. Alright, that would be that would be good enough. So yes, I need to fill it up with bird wings, but I need to make sure I need to fill it up with feathers, but I know I need to make sure that they follow the exact position on that route. So that there is a so there so there is a change. Alright. Good. Finally got that into my in my into my system. Oh no. <laughs> my head. All uh, right. Um, I'm gonna be calling it here for today. I guess. Yes. It's one o one o'clock already. Um. Anyway. Um. 
I wish you all uh, I wish you all a good I wish you all a good uh, a good day and I hope you all uh, I hope you all enjoyed for today what I did and thanks for watching and until the next time bye